Well, hey there. I guess I don't need this anymore. Because I'm busted. Hello, everyone. Today is a special edition of AKB Bags because today we're going to talk about her birthday. Stay tuned. Hello and welcome to the Babe Cave with no other than Mr. AKB Bags. <laughs> and uh, he has quite the story for my birthday bag and how I got it and what he picked out first. So I will hand it over to him to talk about my birthday bag. Okay, so where to start? At one point in time, Miss AKB Bags bought a Pride Rowan coach bag that she thought she would use and she liked the colorway. She didn't go to it very often, so she listed it. And finally, somebody bought it. And so she sent it through USPS it made its way all the way to Kansas City, Kansas, to the big hub there, and got lost in the ether. Completely in the void, they couldn't find it. We wrote to them, we talked to them on Twitter, every possible means to reach out to USPS or the postmaster or my local postmaster to try to find this and dig it out, but we tried. So what ended up happening, is she ended up getting refunded and so did the gal that bought it and it was never found so i know she liked the uh style of the bag itself the rowan maybe not the particular one that she sold so i got to thinking she likes the wesselman x she's got one in a road the lips and I so she really likes the wesselman style the x uh, and that's a rogue right there. And so myself thinking I'm just so smart and brilliant and I've watched all of her videos. I got it all figured out now. I can pick her out a birthday purse and it's it's gonna be it's gonna be perfect. I mean look at her shirt even. Okay, so I thought I was on top of it. So the coach outlet has a Wesselman, it's a canvas, it's all over, the lips are all over it, and I thought for sure, oh yeah, I got this, she's gonna love it. And I'm terrible at surprises, so I was hitting around to her what I picked out for her birthday. I basically begged her to let me try to pick one out for her on my own and see how I did. And me being terrible at surprises, and I finally gave it up. She took a look at a picture of it, she's like, I don't think so. So, gentlemen. If you have a bag of fishing auto for a wife, probably not a good idea to try to pick one out on your own. I did it. Now I had the right idea, just the wrong execution. So before the bag even got to us, I had already scheduled a return. So it literally got through the door, got picked up, went right back. Never opened, didn't even look at it, didn't even entertain looking at it. So what I asked her to do was to find that specific style the rowan and i know right now denim is hot it's all the rage yes. and she's done a few videos of the denim that she has and so with that she found what she thinks is the perfect rowan bag for her birthday i get credit just for the thought of it for that style but all credit where credit is due mrs akb bags found this bag for her birthday and this actually took really long to get here as well, right after we had lost the Coach Pride bag. This one was stuck in the same location for a long time. So then I thought, I've lost another bag. Well, you know, that was going to come to me. So this took a really long time to get here. It's the denim collection from the outlet last year 2023 the regular sized rowan leather on both sides gold hardware beautiful denim dark denim with the zipper on the back i i just really liked this and feet on the bottom very important to us and i really do appreciate that he tried and it's the thought that counts, right? And, you know, I I really wanted to see what he could do and what he could find. And 
he was he was close but as a bag lover who searches on the internet all the time and looks at a billion bags all the time I know my measurements I like I know my style what I'm looking for and that Wesselman was just I didn't want lips all over I I I like my rogue with the lips and my charms but I just wasn't into it but that doesn't mean that the thought was there. He put thought into that purchase and I appreciate it and I love him. And he is a huge support. Uh, he is the one that does my thumbnails with all the bright colors and the fonts. So he helps me out with those and I appreciate him. And I, I do like my new Rowan. Finally have a Rowan back in my collection. I just wasn't carrying the multicolor Rowan, which I thought I would never sell. And uh, I did sell it, and then it got lost. So, I don't, I don't know. And this one was no different. It literally made its way from wherever it launched from. Got to Kansas City, Kansas, and again, lost in the void. Mm -hmm. I had to start, you know, it took about three or four days. I was able to go in and start uh, a search for it. And... Locally, I had to search for it. This one I really hammered on because we, at that point, were so tired of losing bags through that hub that I had reached out to even DeJoy, the guy at the very top. I, you know, didn't get a response. But, I mean, I, I emailed everybody. Mm -hmm. And so, finally, this one shook loose and got here, which we were surprised that it ever even got here. But yeah. here it is, <laughs> Divine Intervention birthday bags in hand yes she's able to enjoy it it's denim so denim's cool and here's the strap oh, you've all seen the the coach Rowan many a times I'm just really into top handle bags and of course denim and so this was a great price because I've seen these going for a lot more than what I paid so I was really frustrated when it took forever but it got here and I I used it this weekend for my birthday weekend and uh, I really enjoy this Rowan and I'll think of the saga and the stories that came along with it and I really do love it and thank you. You're welcome. And again, I want to uh, wish Mrs. AKB Bags a happy birthday. Aww. Uh, I hope that it was a good weekend. Um, Unfortunately, we went to a restaurant that we used to go to, and it's kind of not where it used to be. But we'll do a do-over, and that's for another time. And, you know, it's any excuse to go out for another date, another dinner mm -hmm. is fine by me. Uh, but, yeah, I'm glad she's happy. Um, I'm glad the wrong bag went back without even being open. That way, when somebody else got that bag... It literally is untouched, and we all know how Coach wraps, even probably the outlet, wraps mm -hmm. everything to a T. So nothing was touched. So anybody that got that bag, I never put a hand on it. Um, we think it's still on the website as yeah. well. So. They have a gazillion of them. What, they're about $130 a piece, so go ahead and check one out. I'll have her post it up there or over there or somewhere. It, wherever. it, it might be other people's uh, preference of bag, but it just wasn't mine, and... I like special looking bags and art collabs, but I just didn't like the lips all over the canvas. It just, it wasn't for and me. And they were all over. <laughs> all over. Like, of course, yeah, we looked at the website and they're, they're all over. <laughs> I'm like, no, I don't think that's for me. I knew right away when she looked at the picture, she was like, so, yeah. Also, yeah. I got some wind chimes with a cool little light and I'll pop up a picture and video in between us right here of this uh it's real subtle bells I mean a softer tone and it has this LED light that or solar light that lighted at night so I'll and it glistens on top of the porch so I'll pop up a video here and so shout out to you Lindsay thank you it's beautiful I love it and he loves it too it's pretty cool <laughs> so
So that is the birthday weekend. Yes, we are posting it late because we've just been enjoying doing other things. My daughter's in a play. We've just been busy. So we finally sat down together and uh, don't give him too hard of a time. He really did try. I and did. I did. You know, most husbands don't even do that. So I appreciate the thought that went behind it. And uh, us ladies can be really picky. Like, you all know. So let me know down below if your husband tried to buy you a purse. or <laughs> And how did it go? Or did you pick it out <laughs> like I did? Let, let us know down below. And I appreciate all of my new subscribers. Uh, we're, I'm trying to reach 2,000 subscribers by the end of the year, uh, so don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It's free. And since today is actually her birthday, uh, thanks to everybody, all of her friends on here mm -hmm. that have reached out to her on Instagram or mm -hmm. via text. I know some of you got a personal number, uh, some on Facebook to wish her happy birthday, so we appreciate that. Quick shout out to Says What? There's something very, very exciting coming up, yes. and I swear, lady, you're clairvoyant. Uh, you'll find out soon enough, but we are in, in shock and awe by what you did. So, mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, so you don't want to miss that special unboxing, plus I have a couple of others, because I hadn't bought anything in a while, and then I went a little crazy, so there's some unboxings coming up. And I think that wraps it up and uh, to another year around the sun and uh, on to the next one. You know, it's better than the alternative, right? <laughs> so thank you again for all the birthday wishes. It's been a great weekend and minus the Mexican food fail, but you know. And the Wesselman X, <laughs> <laughs> don't, that's a fail too. It's a learning process. Learning process. But guess what? I am never, never <laughs> ever going to try to buy another handbag on my own without like some forethought or looking over her shoulder when she's on her phone scrolling through what she looks at. Sometimes she takes three or four looks at something. and So attention to detail, gentlemen. That's all you can do. And yeah. then hope for the best and, and go from there. Mm -hmm. But uh uh, thanks uh, again for inviting me back on your birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> I love you. And thank you to all of her friends and fans on here. And keep watching, like, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell for further videos. And we'll see you soon. Bye.